selfcom slash Sri Ragamu. Have a look at the description for the link. Repeat. Yes, is after singing, so he does a loop. 31636. Sri Ragamu. 6863. 3363. As you can see, those uh, slides are happening again and again. If you look at the scale of the song at later time, Raga, the practical application is knowing where exactly to play. As you will see, the frets are being repeated. Take a note of the frets which we are using again and again for the song. That will already give us the scale information so that you will go beyond just remember and repeat to understanding the music. Continuing. 363. Second string 624. 486 hit on 44 four, repeat like before Nin Maunamo 4868 fast slider 4868 3866 slide hit on 6 686 8646 slide which can also be played like hit on the 8 pull to 6 on the 2nd string 4 and back to 6 it's a little bit difficult in the beginning to play pull off on the second string without making the first string sound too much there's a small trick involved here where you are muting the string with the index finger have a look in the description for resources will help you start playing Indian guitar more fluently including all these exercises possible combinations where you can practice hammer-ons and pull-offs slides and other moves first time 3 to 8 slide 8 to 10 and hit on 8 if you feel like that 11 is sounding better for me, I like the 11 better. You can go to 11 and see. Otherwise, 8 to 10 and come back to the 8. Nindragamo. 3, 8, 6, like hit on 6. Or 3, 8, 6, 8. In Munil. 3, 8, 6, 8. 8, 11, 10, 13, 11. If you observe Yeshita singing, a lot of times you will notice this kind of a cross stitch kind of movement happening between the notes. Notes are 8, 10, 11 and 13. But in, in order to reach there, in order to cover all of them, we use 8, 11, 10, 13, 11. Hit on the 10, already slide to 6. Then 6 to 5 slide. 5, 6, 5 fast slide. 5 to 1 slide. 3, 3, 2, 1. 1, 6, 3 slide. Hit on the second string 6, slide to slide from 6 to 3. 